Hi everyone, today I am going to discuss about how to score 30 out of 30 mark in first PUC physics annual practical exams. As I discussed in previous video, there is a total 30 mark for your practical exam in that 20 mark is for practical doing practicals means performing the experiment and remaining 6 mark is for practical record you are calling it as a journal okay. certified journal you will get 6 mark and remaining 4 marks that is main important many of the students fails to attend the viva questions why because they don't know what type of questions is asked by the examiner during the practical exam today I am mainly concentrating about the viva questions because viva questions also makes an important in scoring out of out marks in practicals here in generally the examiner is going to test your basic knowledge or fundamental knowledge about the experiment okay. about that only the examiner is going to ask the questions means the what is meant by physical quantity and what is its formula what is its dimension formula what is its SI unit in which quantity it belongs either scalar or vector like that questions you may ask and if you get uh, uh, experiments like vernier calipers, scrivgas, spirometer in annual practical exam the examiner may ask the questions like what is the formula of least count and what is the formula of total reading and what is the least count value of vernier calipers or scrivgas or spirometer and how you are going to convert the units from one unit to another unit means conversion of length in different units like that questions you may get and in case of beam balance this experiment is related to mass and weight the examiner may ask the questions like what is meant by weight what is meant by mass and how you are converting the gram to kg and what are the different units of mass like that questions you may get in your exam and in case of sonometer here you may get the questions like what is meant by frequency what is its unit and what is length what is uh, its unit and length belongs to which quantity like that questions you may get and also how the mass is related to length such type of questions you are getting in exams and in case of Newton's law of cooling the questions are like what is meant by temperature and what are the temperature measuring scales and different units and how the state of matter is converting from one state to another state like that questions you may get in exam and in case of simple pendulum and spring constant you may get the basic questions like what is the amplitude what is the time period what is the frequency and its units okay. like that questions you are going to get in your practical exam so you have to answer for such type of questions in the during the exam for that you will get four mark this four mark makes an importance in the scoring out of four marks okay thank you